Same heart, just a little bit bigger. This is actually not a good thing. We call this ventricular hypertrophy. This is when the ventricles stretch too much from chronic fluid overload. And this means that they do not pump the same. If you miss this on your care plan, your patient can actually deteriorate fast. Ventricular hypertrophy happens when the heart is overworked and it's often due to chronic preload. The ventricles stretch to compensate, but over time they actually lose pumping efficiency. This then triggers the RAS system. Renin, angiotensin, and aldosterone work together to retain fluid and constrict blood vessels. The kidneys hold on to sodium and water, and the heart ends up actually doing more work under more pressure. Some nursing priorities in heart failure include restricting fluids and sodium to reduce that preload, administering diuretics like furosemide to remove excess fluid, monitoring daily weights to catch fluid retention early, and assessing breath sounds for crackles and signs of pulmonary edema. If you skip these, your patient may experience worsening heart failure, respiratory distress, or hospitalization. If you comment heart down below, I will send you the full heart failure care plan cheat sheet with the RAS breakdown, nursing priorities, and medications you need to know.